jacket on the inside of the gloves. Doesn't seem like it'll be a good idea or a good day. Hey guys, how you doing? The best one. Hey, out for a, I guess you could say it's a rainy start to the trip. Yesterday was my birthday. Really nice, nice day. My mother uh, still calls me her baby boy. <laughs> She's like, ah, my baby boy. I was like, oh, ma, alrighty. So uh, yeah, we. Uh, she came up and hung out for the day. We went for dinner. My dad called me earlier. Uh, he's back to commuting to work. From COVID, he was working from home, and he's like, oh man, I don't know if I can. I don't know if I can do this anymore. <laughs> uh, he's so used to, uh, oh wait, no, oh shoot. Yeah, he's so, he's so used to commuting. I thought that was actually the turn for the exit. He was, he's so used to being home that now when they're like, oh yeah, you gotta come back. He's like, oh man, I don't know if I feel like doing this anymore. Yeah. So uh, starting a trip to Ohio. A little bit of rain here to starting out. Looking forward to hitting the the triple nickel tomorrow. And uh, just having a good time and enjoying the ride. I figure we'll start it out with a little vlog for a little while. Won't be too long, but just kind of to bring you in. I just gassed up. Spent the uh, last two days kind of just looking over the bike a bit. Just making sure, uh, you know, it's pretty much all right. Woo! What a dip that was, huh? Brother's coming on. So we're going to get on the highway here. Got the moisture. Get the wicking, wicking away. So I don't have my pin lock on, so I have to, uh, I have to actually crack my visor a little bit. Let's see if I can close it down a little bit more. It is a little tough to do, but yeah, there's really not like a, a slightly cracked feature. It's either it's, uh, it's either the visors opened quite a bit or it's not so there's really not much of an in-between for me either way yeah the start is gonna be a little bit of a rainy ride so we're just gonna take our time and just make our way on to where we gotta go I think the further west that we go the less, uh, hopefully, the less rain clouds we'll run into. But we might be in rain probably for like, I don't know, a good hour and a half or so. Maybe more, maybe two hours. The whole trip is supposed to take me eight. So that's why I was trying to get on a, get on a road now, of which it is, time check, it is 6.14. So not much point in me looking at time <laughs> yeah gotta crack this again yeah guys so not much point in me looking at my time that's not gonna do me very much good so yeah hope you guys have been good uh 
uh, for my birthday, my wife got me uh, Gore-Tex, these Gore-Tex gloves, which have been just amazing. Well, how they feel amazing. We took a ride down to Cycle Gear, and I figured what I would do was try on a couple of them and see which one we liked. And I tried on a couple and kind of wasn't too fond of some of them. Some of them I was just like, all right, you know, this is, I don't know, this is just not gonna work. I don't really like the way this, this looks or feels. And then there were some other ones that were just a bit, just a lot better. Uh, and then it came down to this Alpine Star and also came down to price. Because <laughs> there was one Alpine Star, oh my God. It felt amazing. But it was 300 bucks. You know, I had the Gore-Tex line in and everything. It, 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 uh, it wasn't too thick. It was like just right. Man, it felt amazing. Like, I really couldn't believe just how good. I couldn't believe how good it felt, to be honest. And when I tried it on, I mean, I just, I was just blown away, but. I was like, man, I was like, you know, I was like, it's just, it was just way out my price range for the point, for the, for where I wanted to spend. So, they did have a lower model, Alpine Star, which I will show you, but you won't be able to see, because it's dark. And they were 150, and they had a very good, very good fit also, so. I said, you know what, I think, uh, I said, I think I'm going to go with these because the fit was really nice and I, I really like the fit and I said you know what I said yeah I could go with these and these I could use so that's what I have on now they're waterproof they have Gore-Tex lining um, they were a little thick so you know tactability you kind of lose a little bit of tactability but you know otherwise Otherwise, you know, they're, they're all right. They're not bad. They're pretty good, I would say, anyway. So, I, you know, I can't complain. Right now, I can't complain. For what I need to feel, you know, uh, I, I can feel the indicator pretty good, pretty decent. It's not too bad. So, I, I'm not complaining.